This video outlines in short how you can view information in a clinical trial page in the various sub-tabs, and how to download information related to clinical trials and clinical trial applications. On the Clinical Trials tab, after using any of the search functionalities to locate a trial, click on the EUCT number to open the Clinical Trial page. By default, you will land in a summary sub-tab of the clinical trial you have opened. There, you will find key information about the clinical trial such as the sponsor organization, the therapeutic area, the member states concerned or MSCs, the medical conditions, population type, etc. Below, you will see the overall trial status in each of the MSCs, showing also the start and end of trial dates. In addition to the summary sub-tab, there are a few other sub-tabs that provide additional information on other aspects of the trial. For example, the full trial information sub-tab, which shows the data and documents for the latest authorized application for that trial. The visibility of sections of the application will depend on the user profile. In the trial results sub-tab you will have access to the trial summary of results, the layperson summary of results, and the clinical study report or CSR in case they have been submitted. More information on the content of the sub-tabs can be found in the other training materials of this module. If you need to find information related to each of the clinical trial applications or non-substantial modifications that are related to that clinical trial, you need to scroll down to the end of the summary page. In the section Application and Non-Substantial Modification, all the applications and non-substantial modifications are listed. Use the ID reference to access them. By clicking on the ID reference of the initial application, you can open the clinical trial application page and see the various sections on the left. You can download clinical trials or clinical trial applications information in three different ways, depending on what you are looking for. The first way is located on the right side of a search results list, after you run a search. If you click on the download button you will be able to either download results or download trials. If you click on download results, you will download a CSV file listing the results you have retrieved with your search. If you click on download trials, a page will open listing the pre-searched trials. You can select the trials you want to download using the checkbox on the left side, and clicking start download on the right hand side of the screen. You will download a zip folder that contains all the structured data and the submitted files. The second way is to download all or part of the documentation associated to a specific clinical trial or its related applications. Click on the clinical trial to open it. Click on the download button located in the upper right corner of the clinical trial page. You can see two sections. The first section is related to the applications of the clinical trial. Click on the arrow to expand the section. Use the radio button to select the application. Then, in the two expanded areas below, select the part of the dossier you wish to download in the format of the structured data. The second section contains additional information related to the notifications, corrected measures, assessments of additional information, clinical study reports, the summary of results of a clinical trial, or inspections. Use the checkboxes on the left side to select any of them. In this example, the user is downloading the cover letter of the initial application in PDF and the clinical study reports. After the selection, click on the star download button on the top of the screen. The third way is to download specific documents from a clinical trial application page out of a list of documents. To do so, open a clinical trial. Scroll down to the section Application and Non-Substantial Modification and open one of the applications or non-substantial modifications. In this example, open the initial application, select Part 1 or Part 2, scroll down to locate the full list of associated documents and click on the document symbol that appears on the download column on the right-hand side of the table. The selected document is downloaded. According to which of the three ways you use, you can download from a big set of structured data and documents, to just one specific document. This video is part of the CTIS training program.
For more information on the search functionalities and how to view and download clinical trials and clinical trial applications related information, you may visit our training platform and our additional materials.